speaker will be Mr. Joseph Palilla. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate being here. I uh, had uh, breakfasts in this cafeteria. I went to Star of the Sea. And uh, you have my brochures, my cards, and stuff on the table. And a pen. Help yourself. Go to the website to learn more about me. Uh, tonight, I'm here first. I want to thank the press for getting me a lot of additional votes today in their endorsement of Mr. McQueen. <laughs> and I want to address the, the one point that they said about me, or the two points, that I'm a theatrical uh, entertainer and uh, have wild ideas. I wanted to tell you some of them wild ideas, like less spending, trim the budget, park the cars, cut down on the cell phone use, the five-year tax abatement plan was my plan, letting council know that they could strengthen the state law was I conveyed that information to council. The trust funded Bader Field so they couldn't touch the money if they tried to sell it. Lease Bader Field, don't sell it. I believe the city of Atlantic City spends money for audits. Those audits and the recommendations in them should have been implemented. The past government here, all governments, have never implemented many of the recommendations made by the auditors that they paid for. Also, um, Bader Field um, should not have been closed. I believe it was closed prematurely. I attended all the meetings. The people didn't want high rises over there. They want the boardwalk developed first. The press reporting of those meetings was the complete opposite of what went down in those meetings. Some people may have backed me up on that. The city of Atlantic City has mixed use in the master plan. I agree with that. I uh, wish that uh, I would try to implement another early retirement program in the city of Atlantic City so people could retire. I was uh, responsible for uh, negotiating contracts that assisted the employees to get post-retirement medical benefits after working their entire life when they received a very low pension and would have had it uh, by uh, health care and only wind up with $300 a month after they retired. Um, it was my idea to move the public welfare assistance to duplication and waste of two welfare departments, move it to the county. That happened. I suggested to the city that the city library should be moved into the county library system, which would save uh, millions of dollars. I want the uh, parking fee removed from the residents and property owners here to have to pay to park in front of their own house. Uh, there are the wild ideas that the press is afraid of. I know the press doesn't like me because I had them thrown out of City Hall and had them because I wanted rent for the room that they occupied for about 15 years without paying for it. <laughs>